possibly go wrong? Oh god. Yeah, someone's stopped already up there. I just want to keep big gaps. Yeah, it's Tony. Right. Really don't want to be stopping anywhere. Okay, that's the hardest sound just there, isn't it? Yeah. We agreed on this bit? Yeah. Just here. <coughs> Look at that, that's very calm today. How's the drone? Oh, it's beautiful in the sea. Just washes your troubles away. Yeah. <laughs> All set, looking good. Thank you. I'm trying to run me over. Don't blame him. Yeah. <laughs> Wayne crashed into the man's long thing. He was hitting the donkey and Wayne crashed into the back of his knobbly bit. Well done. He deserved that. Yeah. Hit that donkey again, I'll whack him with a load of hay to the fucking cleaners. <laughs> oh, well, we didn't cause an international incident, no. so that was pretty good. <laughs> he did that on purpose. <laughs> Crash into the that goes straight through a radiator. Hey, should have a fluorescent jacket on the back of that. Yeah. Don't do it again. Stop it, that donkey. Yeah, 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 yeah
<laughs> the donkey. Who's in this bloke was hitting the donkeys? He was it? beating the donkey up, so I'd give it hit his bit of wood and got on his feet. <laughs> I said to my God, give his give his give his bit of wood a nudge. And he didn't, it fell off. <laughs> did we crash into everybody who was hitting the donkey? We crashed into all of them. We did it. We are now in no man's land at the beginning of the minefield. Are you ready for this band? Oh Honestly, you've got to drive through the minefield at least it's once in your life. Uh, I drove through both times, I think. It's fair. It's fair. So in 75, this was heavily mined. Because of all the conflict. This whole area. It's left and right, this is minefield. <laughs> So now I'm going to make Sammy drive through the minefield, which has been, been cleared, but that bit hasn't been cleared, so that's all mine's now. Well, Chris will be interested in this. Look, Chris, they've tarmacked it all. We used to drive across the nice sandy land mining bits. There used to be piles of cars. There used to be piles of cars all the way around. They've tidied it up, all the ones that have blown up and stuff. But now, they've even sanitised the minefield of No Man's Land, which is desperately upsetting. I was so hoping you were going to drive through boom, boom, bang, bang bits. Thanks, Dad. Oh, never know, I might crash into crash the back Connie, yeah. Uh, it turns out they've only tarmacked the half that was Moroccan. <laughs> the half that's Mauritanian is still good old fashioned minefieldy type nastiness. You'll hear a boom, tick, 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 bang! And then it goes, front end gets lost. Getting to Mauritania. Only took nine hours. Well, that's not bad. I've waited 14 hours at that border before, but you got your little stamp. Honestly, Mark almost hit someone. Yeah, well, he's been there a long time and he's done it a this few guy times. Was pushing in, yeah. And Mark was like, Can you stop pushing me? And this guy started on Mark. Yeah. And then Mark was just like, No, don't push me. <laughs> it looks so sunburned on my face. Brilliant. Let's jump in temperature. Mm. We are in Mauritania eating tomato crisps. Only took us about 10 hours to get through, which I consider a personal best. We're not quite three hours we promised, there we go. Funny. So, we're looking forward to potholes. And this is the biggest pothole so far, is the entire stretch of road that's just disappeared. Alcohol we had, but he broke it. Which is 
standing in. Why does he always look like a three-year-old which is about to piss himself? <laughs> he does, yeah. Not but? No. Taking a breather, Buck. We have a truly important problem. The gin's gone. Where? No. We had a slight vodka leak. Vodka? vodka? How slight? How, how did you leak? Well, vodka? that's that's what we're we're trying to figure out. Is how slight? Did he undo the lid? I uh, put it in a. Uh, it probably got got pinched by uh, the uh, packing. Is uh, you know. Some people. She's going up on the roof. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Well, you'll figure it out. Mark's taking his sump out already. He's right over there. That can be a problem. Oh, that's not good. Oh, it's oil cooler, I think. It's near the front, isn't it? It's near the front, but I think it's from the... She's fixed. I've got the oil in it. Suspension lift. Look at that. That's better where it shows higher than it was ever was. Some fixed. Chuck all that oil in it. Let's get it going. Sorry, we can't really slow down because otherwise we'll just dig in. That way, this now is look at this sand, see the sand is hard, so... Yes. Have you turned that off? Oh, no, I haven't. I was going to turn it off. Yeah, Mark's very low car, with no sun guard. Went on the desert bit for... How far, Wayne? Not even two miles. Quarter of a mile? Yeah. Half a mile, and immediately put a hole in the sun. Uh, which we just tipped on its side and repaired with dodgy chemical metal, not the real deal. But hopefully it'll stay fixed. We'll turn up to the sand dunes where we're going and um, we'll have a look at its side properly, but hopefully we fixed it. Possibly we fixed it. Right, so we got Sammy up on the roof. We're towing Mark because he didn't have a sump guard or a spare wheel. Um, or any suspension on one side, so that was a bit of a problem. But we're doing right, we're good. He's <laughs> off. Camel chasing. Run, Forest. Run. He's got that.
<laughs> I look good. <laughs> Did it, we made it. That sand was about as sticky sand as you get. Lost. As long as we don't slow down, we're good. But as soon as we slow down, it goes. Yeah. There was two tracks and 